One thing that I've learned the last couple of days from listening to my podcast, mainly Joe Budden and Queens Flip going through his things. Remember I said it a couple of, a couple of, damn bro, I had a nasty pimple right here and I just had to pop it and now look, it looks stupid. But anyway, so I told you a couple, whatever these are, videos, vlogs ago, how I was watching, I could, I could, it's not hurt, no, it's not hurt. Don't worry about it, I just had that, yeah, it was a little, anyway, so I seen how Queens Flip is trying to make a change in his podcast, and I'm like, bro, he's from, and he has mad energy, and we don't mean to be that way, but maybe it's best for me to go ahead and make a change too, you know, let me go do things that I know I should do, and I just don't want to do, and it worked for me with my legs and everything else, right? So I said, you know what? Bring called the crib. Mom picks up. I said, I just wanted to call and just say hi. And we looked talking for like 10, 15 minutes. Then my dad and I talked, spoke for a little bit. Man, let bygones be bygones, bro. They old. I'm older. I made my mistakes. I didn't run. I didn't do the workouts. I because you know what? No matter what everybody said to me, if I would have prepared and trained the proper way. I wouldn't even be right where I'm at. So, I got to do what I got to do and let things go so I can move forward. And maybe that'll get my body loose as well. So, I know I keep preaching to the choir. I know I keep saying this shit over and over again. But, let bygones be bygones. I ain't mad at nobody. Because you know what? When I was naive, I felt better. I felt way better. But when you become aware and you allow the trauma to consume your mind, it consumes your body. And when it consumes your body, you put that shit out. Now, I say I got good energy, which I probably do a lot of the times. But that one split moment where I'm thinking about something, that's like me having back problems again, where I was irritable and I was thinking about how to get rid of the pain. And then I took a step and I said, shit, fuck them. And I made everybody fucking go, oh, shit, this big ass dude just, oh, I'm scared of him. So I had to let that, I had to let, I had to go ahead and let some things go. So I, or I'm trying, I'm, I'm in the process. I'm not, a, I'm not a master at it yet. I'm just starting to practice. All right. So hmm, A for effort, at least right. Honestly, I'll give myself a C plus. 